Hi, my name is Barbara Klinky. This is Verina High School. This is a Bio 1 um, CES class. So these students are from the Center of Environmental Science and Sustainability. And today we're going to be modeling the cell membrane. All right, so you guys just did a reading um, looking over the structure of the cell membrane. So can someone remind me what the function of the cell membrane is in a cell? What you got? Hold on, hold on, hold on. What you got? Right, it allows things to move in and out of the cell. So that's what we're going to be modeling today. So you've got um, all of your candy right here. Since it's Halloween, we're gonna be using some candy and then you guys will be able to eat these after you're done, please. Okay. So you've got, and I'll go ahead and go to the assignment. We'll go right here. Okay. So you have, right now, you have a Twizzler in front of you that you will break in half. You have 16, no. listen, hold on. Wait and then we'll, and wait until I go over the directions and then you guys can get started. So you will have, um, like I said, you have the Twizzler. You have 16 Dum Dum Lollipops. You have um, four, I, got, I went ahead and gave you four of the Sour Patch Bites. Okay, you have a gummy worm, which is here. Um, you have wax paper. Um, you don't have a permanent markers. You can use um, either your, just your pencil or there are markers that you can use um, and you'll use those to write on the wax paper, okay? So your instructions are to using the materials that are provided to you. You can use your notes from last class on the cell membrane as well as the picture uh, on the lab itself. But you guys are going to use these items to model the cell membrane, okay? There are, in total, there are four main parts that we need to know about the cell membrane. So what are the four um, structures that we need to know about the cell membrane? What you got? Um. Okay, so we have a protein channel. So something's gonna represent the protein channel. What else? Nick Lowe, what you got? Phospholipid what? Bilayer. Yes, so the phospholipid bilayer. We got two more. What you got, Xavier? Cholesterol. And last thing, what you got? Carbohydrate chain. Very good. So here are the four things that you're going to need. And I'll leave these up for you. So you guys are going to, on the wax paper, use the candy to model um, your cell membrane, okay? Um, when you're done with that, there is a picture on your lab that you are then going to, you're basically gonna fill out the legend or the key with what each um, item represents and then you're gonna color it in, okay? So that's gonna be part one, okay? I'll be around to help. I'll give you about 10 minutes to go through part one where you're just setting up your cell membrane. Does anybody have any questions right now about what you're doing before we get started? All right, go ahead and get started. Is the, the nerds are gonna come during part two. So you don't need nerds right now. The nerds and the double bubble you don't need right now. So we can kind of put these to the side for right now. Okay, you already ripped the Twizzlers too. Uh, One thing I forgot to mention, the nerds and the double bubble are gonna come later. Okay, so just kind of keep it, yeah, for right now, just set them to the side. They can very much. Split Sour Patch yes. bites in the four So think about, which, think about what each okay. part is gonna do. Um, think, start, I would start with the fossil lipid bite. Like, what's gonna be your fossil lipid bite? Exactly. And then for making build a model, use right. the diagram so, and build it. Once you yeah. build your model, label one side. But you have to figure out which one's going to be which. So what are the dum dums going to represent? What do the dum dums look like? Mm -hmm. 
Out of protein these four. No, 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 not protein channel. Out of these four things that I listed, what do the dum dums kind of represent? Like? Phospho. Say it, phospho. Lipid. Yes. So see how it look? See how they kind of look like dum dums? So I would set up your phospho lipid bilayer first. Okay. Uh huh. Is this the inside? This the outside? So the outside of the cell is this. This half. And then inside is this. Oh. So you're just making like the layer around the cell. I understand. Can't explain to them. Yeah. Alright, it looks good. Make sure it's a bi layer, guys. It's a bi layer. Perfect. That looks good. It's a bi layer. So, do you have a bi layer right now? You just have a uni layer. This is the outside. And then make sure you do it on your wax paper. Okay, okay. You need how many layers? Two. So, it should, yes, what Elise is doing here. Okay, well, yeah, 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 you were doing it right. Yeah. Oh. All right, come on. You need a bi layer. Oh, 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 is that facing the right way? Oh, 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 there you go. All right, keep going. Yes, very good. Is that what the protein channel looks like, though? What does the protein channel look like? All right, good, good. That looks good. Uh, does this then we should also have one? Wait, I think th that these come out of this. So this is like a chunky thing that stands out. So remember, you need cholesterol and carbohydrate chain. That's what you don't have left. So the the straws and the gummy worm are two different things. They don't they don't connect. So think about it. Think about it. Oh, I might have missed something. Might have been more gold. I might have missed something. Um, yes, I do. I do. What do you think? Look at your picture. Look at your picture in. Look at your picture. Well, I mean, yeah, you can use kind of both. So, but this picture. Uh huh. So you're gonna have to, you might need to separate it a little bit more for so that you have room. But yes. Oh, I just knocked something down. Um, protein channel. Okay, so what are the straws gonna be? The carbohydrate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it'll be, it'll be uh, like now we need to pull the cholesterol. Cholesterol. Uh huh. Uh huh. So what are the what are the straws represent? What? The the straws. Yeah. What are that are in in the membrane? What do those represent? No, not the peripheral proteins, because the peripheral proteins sit on the, kind of the outside. So what are they rep The cholesterol. And then what does the gummy worm represent? The carbohydrate chain. The carbohydrate chain. So once you, now that you've got it set up, you can color code. Okay, I got it within my peripheral ch channel. Okay. Uh uh. That comes later. What? It, I don't. I explain. Explain to me what you're doing with these. What? 
No, carbohydrate chains are on the outside. This is the carbohydrate chain. Oh. Okay. So what represents the carbohydrate chain? No, that would be the Uh-huh. So where does the gummy worm go? Yeah, and it kind of, see how it kind of sits on top? Yeah, perfect. Okay. All right, and then what, I still don't understand. What are these? What are the straws? I thought they were the, never mind. Right. The, 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 the thing. Okay. What are the Twizzlers? What do the Twizzlers represent? No, you already have the Fossils. Oh, you um. Twizzlers, you can look up there. I wrote them all out. Twizzlers are the protein channel. Okay, so write that down. Twizzlers are the? Protein channel. Protein channel. That means these are the cholesterol. Dum -dums are there you go. So are they, does the cholesterol look like that in the picture? Like in your notes? Are these, uh, what do the cholesterol kind of look like? Oh. Alright, so this looks good. I'm gonna, because it's got to be a channel. Do you know what a channel is? What do you think, like, if when you hear the word channel, what do you think? Yeah, like a... Oh, like, like, you think of, like, twins channeling. So what do you think, what do you think, okay, so what do you think, like, the purpose or the function of the channel is going to be? Bing, 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 yes. So you've got, you're going to have a channel because you want, you want space in between because something's going to go in and out, right? All right, what do you, what do you, yeah, that's fine. Okay, so I like that. Why did you put that there? Ding, ding, ding. Okay, so you've got, it's going to, it's kind of going to like stick out like that, right? What do you have left? Uh-huh, and where's the cholesterol going? Uh-huh, uh-huh, so how would you, how would you do it? Beautiful, gorgeous. All right, let's go over this to make sure that we're all on the same page. So, what did, someone raise their hand and tell me, what did the dum-dums represent? What do you got, Mackenzie? The Okay, so we've got the phospholipid bilayer, we've got the dum-dums, okay? What did you do with the Twizzlers? What do you got, Sam? We've got the protein channel, okay? So you've set up your, pro the Twizzlers are going to be the protein channel. Um, what did you do for the carbohydrate chain? The cholesterol? What did you do for the, oh, sorry. I, I know you, you were saying the, you were saying the gummy, okay. Yeah, so the gummy worm is going to represent your um, carbohydrate chain, which means that the cholesterol is what? What represented your, your cholesterol? The sour, the sour patch straws. Very good. All right. Very good. We're going to move on to part two in just a second. But, um, and just first, um, thank you for coming in today. We hope you enjoyed our lesson on um, cell membrane structure.